done. I'm recording this on May the 4th, so some of you may know it's Star Wars Day, so I decided to wear my Star Wars ears today. So I got a new story for us. You know, it's about dinosaurs, because we know Miss Katie loves dinosaurs. It's called Saturday Night at the Dinosaur Stomp. So look at the front of my book. What does it look like those dinosaurs are doing? Are they taking a nap? No. Are they whispering like they're in the library? It looks like they are having a big old party, getting their booze on. So let's see what these little dinosaurs have going on. This is by Carol Degree Shields and illustrated by Scott Nash. Brand new book that Miss Katie bought last week. Oh, our first one's good to hear it. It says, Word went out across the prehistoric slime. Hey, dinosaurs, it's rock and roll time. Slick back your scales and get ready to romp on Saturday night at the dinosaur stomp. Lots of rhyming words in that one, too. By the lava beds and the tar pit shore, on the mountaintop and the rainforest floor, dinosaurs scrub their necks and tails, they brush their teeth and curl their tails. They're getting all fancy and ready for this big old dinosaur stomp. Looks like they're taking a bath and everything. Then, ready, set, go, they trampled and tromped, <laughs> making dinosaur tracks for the dinosaur stump. Does it look like they're uh, going slow, or do you think they're excited and going fast? I think they're kind of running. Plesasaurus paddled up with a splash. <clears throat> Pro oh, Miss Katie can't say some of these words. Protoceratops brought along her eggs. A batch of bouncing babies followed Mama Mayasaur. A pterodactyl family flew in for the bash. Diplodocus plodded on big fat legs. The last time she counted, she had 24. Oh, goodness. All kinds of fancy sounding names. The old ones gathered in the gossiping bunch, sitting and sipping sweet swamp water punch. Dinosaurs giggled and shuffled and stared, ready to party, but a little bit scared. Why do you think they'd be scared of the party? Why would they be scared? <gasps> Look here. Then, Iguanodon shouted, one, two, three, started up the band by waving a tree. <clears throat> Brachio Super and Ultrasaurus sang doo bop a loo bop in a chorus. Ankylosaurus drummed on his hard shell back. boom a lack a boom a lack a whack whack whack. All kinds of really good musical words in here. <gasps> These guys are even playing some instruments. Pinosaurus stood up to perform and blasted a tune on his favorite horn. They played in rhythm, they sang in rhyme. Dinosaur music in dinosaur time. What kind of instruments are they playing? They've got strings on them, and it looks like they're playing different types of guitars and banjos. There's even a dinosaur drum in back there. How neat. Duckbill thought he'd take a chance. Asked Allosaurus if she'd like to dance. Tarchia winked at the Stegosaurus she liked. They danced together spike to spike. Oh, they're being silly. Love it. The tricycle twist and the Brontosaurus bump. The raptor rap and the Jurassic jump. Do those sound like dances we do? Not any TikTok dances, I know, that's for sure. Tyrannosaurus Rex led a conga line. Carnosaurus captured close behind. They rocked and rolled, they twirled and trommed. There never was a party like the dinosaur stomp. They're having a good old time. Fireworks! I love it! 
The nighttime sky began to glow. Volcanoes put on a fireworks show. The ground was rocking. It started to shake. Those dinosaurs danced up the first earthquake. The party went on. It was so outrageous. They stayed up well past the late Cretaceous. Cretaceous is a time period in which they lived. Oh, what's happening now? They dance and dance, and now it's ready for what? Bedtime, maybe? When the Cenozoic dawned, they were tired and beat. They yawned, big yawns, and put up their feet. And they're still asleep, snoring deep in the swamp. But they'll be back next dinosaur stop. It says they're snoring. What do you think a dinosaur snore would sound like? Would it be really tiny? Or would it be really big and loud? I wonder what it would sound like. And the end. Oh, that was a good one. I really liked that. Makes me want to go put my dancing shoes on. I hope you guys liked Saturday Night at the Dinosaur Stop too. And I will see you next time. Bye.